call us on your cell phone. Call and Mary Hotline Bling. That can only mean one thing. Get it, just get it, just get it. Call and Mary Hotline Bling. That's what it is. <laughs> Welcome to it as we do on a weekly basis. We take on all of your questions and as you know, our lines remain open on 083-913-3728. Chef Matt Manning in the house, put it up top. Yes, please. And Chef Zolanen in the house. Uh, yes, it's been years since we've done that. Uh, but okay, let's get right into it uh, right now with Sally. Sally who gave us a tweet saying, um, how do I make tortillas? Hey, I've, we've never done that before. That is a very good question. We're going to show you how to make some flour tortillas, but it is, the tortillas that you can buy in the shops are really good. Yeah. So if you have the time, do it just once. It's one of those things that maybe you should do just once in your life. Like it's Make cool to impress your friends on a special occasion. Exactly, yeah, exactly. Yeah. So it's very simple. All the recipe takes is it's basically making a dough. Okay. okay? So it's just some flour, mm -hmm. some baking powder, and some butter. So all you do is rub the but mix the dry ingredients. Mm -hmm. just <laughs> and then you rub in the butter until yeah. it's sort of breadcrumb consistency, like you're making pastry. Yes, yes. Okay? And then you add some water, just enough water to make a pliable dough. Mm -hmm. Knead it a little bit, just so it stretches and you work the gluten. And there is no yeast in this. I was it's about to say, bread. no yeast needed. It's a flat bread. Because you don't so want your tortilla to be a tortilla. No, you don't. Tortilla. You don't. Um, and then you just roll it out really thin. A dry pan, mm -hmm. Matt, pop that in there, will there you? There you go, Maddie. Dry, Into yeah. a dry pan, cook it for about three minutes on one side yeah. before you turn it over and cook it on the other did side. You, did you dust it off with a bit of flour first? Well, the, the flour, flour just, to, yeah, just to, to help it roll out so it doesn't stick much. to the... Okay, okay. Yeah. And, then and you that's can it. Have... That's how you make tortillas. Cook them all, put them into the oven, and then they're ready to go. Hey, Mara, why am I tortilla? I'll so dry. So, you know, when you, when, dry, no, listen, you know when you buy a tortilla, <laughs> it's usually not pliable. You have to heat it again oh, before think, you can roll it. I think you can get away with buying your tortillas, but you can't buy your guacamole. No. Oh, yeah, you want to make it guacamole. I agree. Oh, you know how I make it? So, go straight with the avo, some lemon juice so that it doesn't go brown, and then you pepper it full of garlic as much as possible. Okay. Some chili flakes. Quit, quit, quit. Ah, and tomatoes? Tomato. No, no, no. I no, no, no. Tomato makes a good guacamole. That's what uh, the original guacamole. It has to be, has to be ripe. Has to have tomato in yeah. it. Okay. I, might I don't know about your Arsenal guacamole. Oh, gosh. The real guacamole. Wow. Ooh, football rivalry. No, Tottenham guys. Tottenham fan. No. Tottenham fan. All right. <laughs> Let's get to our next question, which came from Colette Orm on Facebook, who says, What can I do or what can I make uh, using bread dough besides making rolls, bread, or fet cook? So you have bread dough. What else can you do with it? Well, we've got dumplings here. Ooh, yes. Um, obviously, a Zola recipe. Mm -hmm. uh, <laughs> I would actually go and make, I would make donuts. If I've got some oh, leftover brioche one. in the fridge, oh, I yeah, always yeah. make donuts. They're mm. perfect dough mm -hmm. to be deep fried, and they come out like little crispy nuggets of uh, sugary goodness. You Yum. just sprinkle over some caster sugar. Yes. And make a little bit of uh, maybe like some strawberry jam, and then just dip them in Ooh. there. Or salted caramel. Yes. Uh, so these are some caramel. really good looking buns. But yeah, like, they are, are, they, are they like, um, you know, like bodambi? Like we, we remember we made the dumbi on, on on the show before. Like a dumpling. Yeah, dombolo. Got, it dombolo. Yes. But these are like mini dombolos that you can serve on plates. These like are dombolos that we steam, so they're like Chinese dombolo. Hey, we <laughs> um, So yeah, so they bao. We call them bao, or they call yeah. them, we call them that too. But they call <laughs> bao, and you steam them. Whereas it dombolo, we put on top of a stew, and then steams that way. Mm. You yeah. can also use these for uh, sweet things as well. Absolutely, like or pizza sweet is a great one to use yeah, bread pizza. dough for. Actually, Absolutely. bread dough is so versatile. You can yeah. do. Most anything with Listen, this. can we carry on with this after the break? Let's carry on. All right, you stay tuned. We'll be right back.